The first forecast for the upcoming hurricane season has now been released, and tonight meteorologist John Dawson has a look at what we all need to know. On my YouTube channel, you can see me interview Dr. Phil Klotzbach from a few years ago at the National Tropical Weather Conference. That's where he always presents his seasonal outlook in the first week of April. But like so many of us, this year he had to work from home. Warmer water tends to be associated with more active hurricane seasons. Makes sense. Dr. Klotzbach started his video conference by reminding us all that unfortunately we can't put the hurricanes into quarantine. The start of the season is less than two months away and it looks to be active this year. So again, 16 named storms, of those 16, eight becoming hurricanes and of those eight, four becoming major hurricanes. His team at Colorado State University prepares their outlook for the entire Atlantic Basin, but he did have a reminder for those of us living along the Gulf of Mexico. There, because certainly the Gulf is plenty hot every year to sustain any a nasty hurricane, but thankfully most years the conditions are other conditions aren't necessarily right for it. However, if something were to develop and track into the Gulf, obviously having warmer than normal waters could potentially fuel it to a stronger intensity. So his message is clear. Always prepare no matter what the forecast says. More active seasons tend to have more landfall. Certainly, even if it's a quiet season, you can have landfall in major hurricanes. The great, the best example I think of that is 1992. CSU was doing seasonal forecasts in 92. Bill Gray had a great forecast of only one major hurricane. We went to late August before we had our first game storm of the year. That was Hurricane Andrew. But obviously, Andrew was a devastating storm. So even though we only have one major hurricane, it certainly caused quite a bit of, obviously caused a tremendous amount of damage. So I think the real takeaway from this outlook is not so much the numbers, but just the reminder that hurricane season is coming. And it just seems like everything takes a bit longer nowadays. So start making those plans and start gathering those supplies. Working from home, I'm meteorologist John Dawson.